All right, this is your boy, Brandon Ashley, class of 2012, repping the Oakland Soldiers. Shout out to my boy, Johnny Hernandez. This is your man, John Hernandez, Next Level Connect, here with my boy, Brandon Ashley. You guys all know who he is, repping with the Oakland Soldiers, putting in work over here at Nike YBLA. Talk about the tournament in LA so far, Brandon. We've been doing great so far. You know, we have four and oh, got one more tomorrow morning. We're just trying to go five and oh out here. Trying to make it to Peach and uh, win everything. I hear that. I hear that. You got some unfinished business this year at Peach Jam, right? Oh, definitely. We lost last year kind of early, and uh, I think that really just messed us up. So, I mean, this year we definitely got a point to prove. We're the best team in the country. I hear that. Okay, I wanted to back up a little bit. I didn't get a chance to interview you during your high school season. So, you know, I just want to talk about talk about your Bishop O'Dell season last year. Um, we had a great season, we made it all the way to state again, but uh, ended up coming short again, once again. So I mean, definitely this next year, our main goal is to win state, like, not taking no for an answer. I gotta get it before I leave for college, man. Just gotta have that win. Gotta have that one thing on my, gotta have that ring. I That's hear you. It. Hey, hey, it won't be complete unless you get that ring, right, my man? Exactly. <laughs> all right, you know, I wanted to talk. How do you think you did personally this year? Um, I mean, it, I didn't really have a great season, but I mean, I did enough to, to get my team to where they needed to be. Finish, finish the season strong with a 26 and a, a nine point, you know, 26 point, nine rebound mm -hmm. game. So I mean, did good, but not where I wanted to be exactly. I wanted to have a more dominant season, I guess. I hear that. Hey, never, you're never satisfied. That's a good, that's a good thing to have, you know, in this game. Yeah. You know what I mean? I wanted to, wanted you to rep your school, Bishop Dell, you know, away from sports and everything. Rep Bishop Odell, how is it as a school over there? Because there's sixth, seventh, and eighth graders looking to, you know, yeah, hey, I mean, following yeah. your footsteps yeah. over there, man. I mean, it's definitely a great school academically. You know, uh, the sports team is real cool. Bishop Odell is just a great school, you know. Got genuine people that really care about you up there. I hear that. Okay, you know, talk about the Oakland Soldiers, man. Talk about your fam, man. Talk about the program, you know. Man, my fam, no doubt. You know, my home away from home. All my bros on the Soldiers, man. Like, we just... It's just a nice squad, you know, we got so much versatility on the team. You can go from one dude, drop 40 one night, and then just shift it over to another dude and go for 40, you know, another night. So, I mean, it's just like we got so many different dudes you can go at, so many different guys that have so much skill. It's just one of the best teams in the country, no doubt. I hear that, I hear that. Okay, you know, I want to touch on your recruiting, you know, a little bit, you know, just start popping off schools, whatever schools you want to mention, man. Um, I mean, I really got the, basically the whole entire Pac-10, you know, there's Kentucky, North Carolina, Wake Forest, Texas. Um, yeah, it's more, but I mean, you know, just yeah, yeah, no, I hear you. I hear you. The ones off the top of the hunt. Hey, hey, you, know, nobody, ain't, nobody, hey nobody you ain't Jay Z. Hey. You ain't Jay Z. I know that. Hey, I know it's hard. You want to mention anybody from the Pac-10 specifically, though? Any school that's on um, you the hardest, maybe from from the Pac-12 now? I can't really say anybody's really hitting me the hardest right now. You know, there's nobody that has an edge over somebody else. You know, I'm still pretty wide open, but I'm hoping to get cut everything down, you know, within the next two to three weeks, maybe to a top 10, make my decision probably early signing period. Okay, cool, cool, good, I'm sure they want to hear. Okay, talk about your strengths to your game. What is the college getting, the lucky college that does get you? Hey, what are you bringing to them? Um, bringing a hard playing guy, leave it all out on the court, going hard every play, um, and a very versatile kind of player, you know, I can go from the four to the three, you know, I can play some wing, solid jumper, and just a, uh, Working on improving everything right now. You know, I can't really say it's a single part of my game that I just have that's just spectacular. You know, I just got to work on everything and just make my game just like solid. I hear that. I know. I, I, I hear that. You're one thing about you that I noticed you're never satisfied. You know, yeah, you can have the most dominant performance and you still have room for improvement. That's what's oh. good about you. I know you touched a little bit on what, what you're working on, but anything specifically that you, you know, that you want to work on to when you get to college, you're, you know, you're, you're even more wild, wild than you are today. Strength and athleticism is, is my okay. main thing right now. Just a uh, strength and conditioning, really. Got to get up and down the court, you know, beat my man down the court, you know, get that open lane and just uh, kill him on a fast break. And then wing game as well. Mm. Working on improving that jump shot and my handle as well. I hear that and get get some pizzas on some people, right? Uh, yeah, got to get them combos out there. I hear that, I hear that. Okay, you know, uh, what we do here at Next Level Connect, we ask some out of the box questions, you know, some quirky questions, you know what I mean? So city and state you were born in? I was born in San Francisco, California. Okay, so you're a hometown dude, huh? Yeah, yeah. Repping the Bay Area to the fullest, got huh? Got you, got I you. hear that, okay. When the NCAA rolls around, who you run with, man? Who's your squad? Man. Does it change year to year? Or it does, does it? It okay. does, you know, depending on who that 
who my, my uh, I guess you could say, big bro is, you know, who I'm looking up to, you know, trying to take some things from my game from. I hear that, okay, you know. Past or present, favorite NBA player? All right, so I'm going to go past first. I'm okay. going to go both. Past would have to be George Gervin. Oh, oh. was just so smooth, so... I don't, I don't even know how to explain it, but dude, like it was real. And then present, I gotta say Kevin Durant right now. Nice. He's a real dude, best scorer in the league, no doubt. 6'10 with a handle, athleticism, jumper, everything. You cannot stop dude. I hear that. Okay, I'm gonna get you out with this, Brandon. You know, if I grabbed your iPod and I started shuffling through that thing, man, what you rocking to? What you got, man? You're gonna hear some J. Cole, no doubt. Okay, okay. You're gonna hear some Wiz Khalifa. Okay. Some Barry Love with DB the General. Okay. Oh, man, you know, some Drake, some Wheezy, you know, all of that. You know, I'm pretty wide up when it comes to music, too. Oh, I know that. I know that. All right, my man. Well, I appreciate the interview. All right, no problem.